Hi everyone, welcome to the behind the scenes of Bad Things music video. Show me all the scary parts. I'll follow you into the dark. Firstly, I just wanted to express my gratitude for all the love and support you have shown me. It means so much to me and I just want to tell you guys how much I truly appreciate you. So thank you from the bottom of my heart. Thank you. Now let's get into the creation of bad things. So the meaning behind bad things is very special to me and I relate to it so much and I'm sure you guys do too. It's about wanting to know all the positive and the bad things about someone and loving them unconditionally. And I feel like that relates to so many young people who are in relationships, whether that be friendships, relationships, anyone. And that's what I love about the song, Bad Things. My favorite lyric, it's so hard to choose, but my favorite lyric would have to be, I don't want a pretty light, so hit me with the ugly truth. I love that line. It's about going through hardships with someone and wanting to know the hard truth other than a pretty lie, and I think that will help people grow. Okay, now let's get into the preparation of the music video. So recently, I was in Abu Dhabi with Now United for the Kids' Choice Awards, and as soon as I flew back, the next day, I went into rehearsals, and we just went through the choreography and the layout of how the music video is going to go. I think it worked very well. Lots of it was more like freestyle, but we had like a sudden like vision for the music video. And we had to do that because the concept behind Bad Things was going from sun to the sunset. And that time frame was only three hours. And so we did that in the studio and then we had to choose the outfit and Rosie had the idea of choosing a suit and I absolutely love that idea. It was just so simple. I just wanted the song to be the showcase like in the music video so I wanted to be very stripped back, very cohesive throughout the music video so we chose just the beach. Because I come from Australia, the beach has always had such a connection with me and I really wanted this music video to represent me and what I do. Anyways, that was it for preparation and then we went to the location. We were in Malibu. It was an hour drive and we had to hike our way down. I wore the wrong shoes. Do you see those stairs? Oh my God, it's like parkour. So we all hiked down to the location and it was so beautiful. Wow, this is so pretty. So we went through each section and we decided to shoot in order of the song. We don't usually do that in Now United, so it was a very different process for me. I had to really think of the lyrics and just be on top of everything because once we started shooting, it was, it was go, go, go. Push me away, so Show me all the scary parts. Show me all the scary parts. the dark. Honestly, I don't remember much from when we started shooting. I was like, everything is such a blur. Right now, because it was so fast, the whole idea of the music video was going from dry to wet, so I had to be dry in these scenes. So the first one was, I was diving onto the sand, and I love that shot, it's such a cool shot. Show me all the scary parts. And then we had to dance. I wanna know all the bad things, bad things about you. I wanna tell you now, dancing on the sand is so hard. Especially in a suit. Love love. And then we moved on to the dancing in the water. I never like really danced in the water on the beach, especially in a suit. It was so like heavy. The water really like weighed me down and I remember this shot. It was like the second take of dancing and I wasn't supposed to get wet. I like I had my extensions in and I remember just losing my balance and just rolling and did like a full contemporary roll to the camera. I kind of wish that they used it in the music video because it was such an iconic moment on the shoot. It would have been so funny to be in there, but it didn't make the cuts. I haven't seen any fans notice this, but my hair fell out like halfway through. Hold on, her hair is falling out. No, I know, I know, I'm trying to find it. My poor extensions, they got ripped out halfway through. I'm sad. I think my favorite shot from the music video is when 
there's water just like going past me and I'm just on my knees and it's like oh, oh, oh. Oh. I think another favorite part of the music video is the ending I love the shots where I'm in the ocean it was just so beautiful and so raw and so it's so cool it's like you guys were like in the ocean with me The waves were getting so big. And I saw one time when I went out, I'd be like, wave, and I'd scream. And he's like going crazy with the camera in the water. Gable, Gable. After the music video, we had to hike up. I was barefoot. The most Australian thing you could do is go barefoot, and I went barefoot up the hill. We made it up to the cars, and I said my last thing of the night. That's a wrap. It's a wrap! Woo! I just wanted to come back and say thank you guys so much for all the support. I've been seeing you guys give all your love for Bad Things Music Video and streaming the song. So keep listening, listen in your bedroom and really listen to the lyrics because it resonates with me so much and I hope it does with you guys. Stay tuned for more things from me. I can't wait to tell you more stories. I love you guys. Good night. Or wherever you are in the world. Good morning, good night. Bye. <laughs>